डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू दिस यूट्यूब चैनल आप खिलेश कुमार असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन इंग्लिश सो इन टू डेज इंग्लिश लिटरेचर क्लास वी विल लर्न अबाउट एलिटरी टर्म लिरिक सो लिरिक is a literary term and uh, this literary term is prescribed in your syllabus be a part second year paper second okay so let's start about lyric 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 is equal to a song okay so you know that in english literature there are so many poems written by poets and some of them having musical and lyrical quality so such like poems are considered as a lyrical poetry lyrical poems okay in the ancient greece the word lyric was employed for any song okay in ancient greece the word lyric was employed for any song okay it means lyric was employed for any song lyric is equal to song okay lyric is the synonym of song and the song was sung with a special musical instrument lyre and the song was sung with a musical with a special musical instrument lyre so there was a musical instrument and name was lyre so the song was sung with that lyre with the passage of time with the passing of time the word lyric emerges as any point of personal emotions and feelings of the poet so the point in which the poet mentions about his personal emotions personal feelings adding some musical quality so called lyric the poet uses rhyme meter and song like quality in a lyrical poetry next every lyric is composed in such a language that every person can understand it easily so every lyric is composed in such a language that every person can understand it easily okay so the language of lyrical poetry is simple easy to understand easy to understand the language of common people so so that every person can understand the language easily one of the most important characteristics of lyric poetry is the expression of personal feelings and thoughts so one of the most important characteristics the poet mentions personal feelings and personal thoughts in a lyrical poetry most lyrical poems are short okay most lyrical poems are short and tend to be written in first person next 
in lyric poem the poet expresses his feelings and emotions okay his personal feelings and emotions this is one of the most important characteristic of lyric poems the poet presents a character in the first person okay so most lyrical poems are written in first person to express his emotions lyric has been derived from a musical instrument lyre as we have already discussed that lyric has been derived from a musical instrument lyre okay in ancient Greece the word lyric was employed for any song and the song was sung with a special musical instrument lyre a lyric poem is often short and non narrative non narrative having some elements of melody so a lyric poem has some element of melody and it is a non narrative poem non narrative it is often short rhymes so these are some examples of lyric poems shall i compare thee to a summer's day by william shakespeare i felt a funeral in my brain by emily dickinson if i could tell you by wh order if i could tell you and last one a dream of fair women a dream of fair women by alfred lord tennyson so these are some examples of lyric points so my dear students this is your lyric and this is a literary term and this literary term is very important in exam point of view also so thank you so much